Good to hear. Bravo. Indeed. And uh, another beautiful day for us. We love it. Just sunny, nice, pretty warm. We're going to do it again. A live look right now at the Dan Ryan. Things moving along nicely at 1019 in the evening. And we have more nice weather ahead. Mary Kay is here with a forecast that we are really looking forward to. Not only is tomorrow Friday, but it's going to be a sunny Friday for you. We are at 68 degrees right now. East southeast winds at five miles per hour. Well, our weather watchers are finding a beautiful night. In fact, skies have been mainly clear across the area, but there are a few things we're going to be watching for tonight. We have 63 degrees when we check in with Terry and he has a clear sky, light winds, but he says ground fog starting to develop. That's going to be the case. Fog early till about sunrise, and that's going to happen at 631. Otherwise, high pressure again, giving us a light lake breeze, a lot of sunshine, and high temperatures above average, low and middle 80s. So it's been so dry all week. I was looking at our rain stats for the month, and we've had just over three inches to the date. On average, we usually have 1.45, so we're just over an inch and a half ahead of the game. So even with this dry trend, we are doing OK. High pressure, keeping things dry. And then, of course, Florence now getting uncomfortably close here to North Carolina's coast. We have hurricane force winds already there this evening. That's going to continue perhaps for the next 24 hours. A dangerous and life threatening storm surge of 6 to 12 feet that could last for 24 hours and then add to that the inland flooding. So you have the saltwater flooding and the freshwater flooding, and that could be because of that localized rainfall we're expecting. It is now Category one winds are at 90 miles per hour. It's moving so slow to the northwest at six. It's going to hug the Carolina coast, probably pass over Wilmington and maybe Myrtle Beach as a category one, and it's just going to bring those repeating rains. Now you see this very balanced looking symmetrical storm and those feeder bands now pounding Wilmington 100 mile per hour wind gusts here along the outer banks of North Carolina. But as you see this counterclockwise turn on the radar, we look at the wind gusts and we're seeing Hatteras 54 mile per hour winds Jackson 55 Wilmington a northwest wind at 55 miles per hour so high winds and heavy heavy rains anywhere between 10 and 20 inches with some isolated 30 even 40 inch rainfall totals because this storm is going to be just staying in place right through the weekend now in Chicago this weekend sunshine will be around the suburbs may flirt with 90 otherwise we'll see the middle 80s tiny chance of rain Tuesday with a front that could bring us some rain and then cooler temperatures but that's the front we're waiting on to finally push Florence away from the United States. All right, looking forward to that. Mm -hmm. Thank you, Mary Kay.